Tom Arnold is still threatening that he has this tape. Apparently, released. he's going to release a tape where he wants to release a recording of Donald Trump on some kind of racist tirade or something along the lines of perhaps what Hulk Hogan went through with Gawker before Hulk Hogan ended up suing Gawker and putting them out of business. And because of that, Hulk Hogan had to leave the WWE Hall of Fame and the WWE got rid of him and they even took him out of their Hall of Fame because of this racist sort of personal rant. However, this rant apparently occurred on the NBC show The Apprentice and the producers or the people involved are scared to death that this is going to get released and they're going to be finished and they're basically frightened of Trump's people. But Tom Arnold claims that Hillary Clinton begged him to release the footage of President Trump using racial slurs just before the November election. He's a 57-year-old. Uh, is Tom Arnold? They write here in an article that I found on the New York Post, NYPost.com, that uh, he repeatedly says the N-word and every bad thing ever, every offensive racist thing ever, but is now saying Clinton called him just two days before uh, they went to the polls, begging him to release it saying that the, uh, basically, what did, what did they say here? Alleging the Democrats said, the weight of free world is on your shoulders. And he says, I'd love to be a hero, but I can't hurt these families, he claims. And he's talking about the families of the producers and the people on the television show. He doesn't want these people to have some kind of insane backlash, despite, um, and, and who knows? I mean, was, was, was Donald Trump joking around on the set for some reason? I mean, you're on a set with cameras and filming and tapes, and for Donald Trump to go on some kind of tirade, I mean, my God, I don't know what he's talking about. Is this BS? Is this Tom Arnold just trying to get himself in the news? Is this a bunch of bullshit, or is this true? Is there a tape out there of Donald Trump being a psycho, going on a crazy racist rant, or is this more liberal BS that Tom Arnold is supplying, trying to be relevant? I don't know, but it is very interesting. I say... Nothing can be proven until we hear this tape. Until then, to me, you have to throw it out. Until we get some actual audio and some actual witnesses coming forward saying, yes, I have heard, I know what he's talking about. Until then, I I basically just think it's a bunch of BS. Release the friggin' tape, Arnold. If something is going on, people should know about it. Despite those few people that, I don't know, what, are they going to be killed? I mean, I don't, I don't know what's going on. But if he actually did go on a purely actual racist rant, the people should have known about it a long time ago. And uh, the needs of the many outweigh the needs of the few. So I call BS, though. I feel like if it was that bad, it would have been released. You would have said, they have to hear it. People have to hear this thing. If it's him just making a joke or saying a word, I, you know, whether that's construed as race, I don't know. We don't know. The bottom line is we're not hearing the tape, so I can't really comment on it. And until I hear a tape, I am going to call Tom Arnold a liar. That's what I'm going to do. What do you guys think? Do you think this is more stuff that uh, the Trump camp should have to worry about? Do you think that Donald Trump is indeed saying these terrible things? Do you think Donald Trump is a racist? If you say Donald Trump is a racist, please tell us why. Because most of the time, it's just something people say. They would have no facts. Maybe he is. We don't know, but there's no facts about it. And here's more yet again being cons basically accused of racism, yet I don't hear the audio tape. Please play the audio tape and we can talk about it. But until then, you got to call it innocent until proven guilty. My name is Joe. You're listening to Shame on News, guys. Thanks for listening. Click that subscribe button. More podcasts coming tomorrow with more news with my buddy Jake and, of course, Dave. We'll be here covering some stuff tomorrow. It's actually kind of interesting, and I think you guys are going to enjoy it. Until then, you can't handle the news. Stay tuned for more news right here on Shame on News.